Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vital Vinyl Vlog. Today we're going to be blasting and going over a release I've been wanting to go over. And I have to thank my buddy down in Texas, Mike, for sending this to the channel. As well as some Profanatica fucking merchandise, which is always sick. We have a nice pin here. And... A couple sick patches, including, you, you, you'll see, I'm making a war metal hoodie. So uh, I'm replacing my conqueror skull on my hoodie to the hood, cutting the sleeves off, putting my black witchery patch on the front, and on the back, this badass Profanatica fucking uh design which i should have grabbed and brought up but yeah another hell's head bangers fucking banger and uh hailing from finland here is the actual artwork to my knowledge i i swear uh this is the art that was on the hell's head bangers band camp but uh, this is Necro Dual Dimension Funeral Storms by Sadakist. And Sadakist is one of those bands that they're just fucking savage and awesome. Hailing from Finland. Yeah. There's something in the water over there. And when it comes to hating Christ and just like evil and writing good riffs also because like this isn't just like some straight up like black death war release this is straight up just black death metal and it's just done extremely fucking well everything about this is top shelf It's squeeze invisible fruit, so like that's how you know it's like yes. 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 Like that sounds like Brazilian 80s like proto black metal thrash. Like early sarcophago sex trash. But I hear a lot of uh necrovore. But, uh, this rules. Because, like, the thrash is there. And, like, that, that's another thing. It makes this so enjoyable. Because it has riffs, people. Like, there's a lot of bands out there that are super fucking sick when it comes to speed. But, like, there's riffs. The drumming is fantastic. Everything about this is, like, on the fucking money. I'm sure it sounds great on vinyl, too. But, like, this is one of those where I'm, like, all right. This sounds fucking, like, super grimy on cassette, but in the best way possible. Like, the production's not crispy, but it's loud, and it's, it's what this needs. Like, whoever did the producing and whatnot, which is all, I'm pretty sure, Mega Hammer. And uh, I, I know this was recorded uh, by Mega Hammer, to my knowledge. And, uh, yeah, they give this album in memory to, uh, Gorophilia's ex-frontman, uh, Henry E. Cola, 1989 to 2018. Like, he and I used to talk and stuff and, like, talk about Gorophilia, like, touring the States and stuff. And whenever I throw on, like, Severed Monolith on vinyl or tape, I just... I don't know, I, I kind of remember those, like, goals that he was telling me and whatnot that, sadly, 
I mean, don't get me wrong, like, I love the new Gorephilia. I was, like, just looking at the fucking tape. The full, well, the LP's right over here. <laughs> I should just grab the LP. But, like, when it comes to Gorephilia, like, the new album, it's good. But, like, it's not as gnarly as Severed Monolith, but it's still really fucking enjoyable. I swore the cassette was, like, right in front of me, but it must have, like, tipped over or something. But, anyways, back to Sadakist. Fuck yeah. Finish Black Death with Thrash Elements. Like, fucking A. Super evil shit, like, and you have, <laughs> you have titles like Enter the Devil, Planet of Shit. Beater of children of God. Driven by disgust, I will fuck tonight. <laughs> Orgy of crime and angel lust. And this was recorded and finished during 2017 to 2018. Mix additional effects and quest solo in Orgy of Crime by Mega Hammer. This work is dedicated to everyone who have supported Sadakist Mission. And uh, we have Sadakist Stalker, Nightmare Vocals, Guitar and Bass. Vortex Armageddon, Solo Damnation Guitar. Saga Teres Perverser. Darkness Drums, The End. Sorry if I mispronounced anything. Once more, just look at how sick that fucking artwork is. And this album is so fucking sick, if you notice. He's got those Will Romer gloves. Look what just popped out of my pocket. Yes. This is that savage that a pair of leather fingerless gloves will just appear after you blast this motherfucker. So Necrodol Dimension Funeral Storms, killer shit from Finland on Hell's Headbangers, savage, sleazy, thrashy, and evil. It's fucking great. I love this stuff. I would say I'm a sucker for it, like thrashy black death metal, that's one of those, like, it's my kryptonite pretty much. And this is killer stuff, if you're a fan of like Perverser, yo, definitely don't sleep on Seda Kiss. But thanks again to Mike in Texas for sending that my way, I appreciate it. Uh, he also sent over Pathetic. Uh, Rat King? I, I've never heard this. I don't really know that much about it. Um, Total Darkness Propaganda? And, uh... I, I mean... Alright. Just by looking at some of the bands they think, I'm definitely interested in checking it out. Okay. Cool. Definitely going to check this out. Sounds... Something sounds like it's up my alley. I just never heard of it, but the cover art's badass. Look at that shit. But, uh, this Sadakist release, like, seriously... Hell's... Like, I'm surprised Hell's still has copies of it. Because this was limited to 200 and released in 2017? Unless it was reissued, like, recently? But this is a fucking ripper from start to finish. Just don't lose the case, cause like you need. It's one of those bands that like the the logo is kind of hard to read, and could be confused with a couple other bands' logos. Like if you just were to drop a tape, like I don't know why you wouldn't have tape shells. Like if for some reason you're collecting cassettes and think it's like. Well, I, I, I'm i guilty of this, and 
All right, I'll show you right now. I'm guilty of this. But you shouldn't do this. It's just this was too good not to cut out. Here's a little blast from the past before I end this video. Some of you might know what this is. Oh, yeah. The Blue Grape Merchandise Company. I had to fucking cut this out. Like, come on. I didn't ruin the entire J card. But this is a piece of fucking history right here. And I just, I, I had, I had to fucking cut it out here. Cause like, let's take a look at t-shirt prices. Uh, cause that's what, that's what these are. Or, uh, all right, there's a couple of hats and t-shirts. Many of the RC slash Roadrunner, Road Racer CDs and cassettes like King Diamond and Sodom that you can't find in your local store are available through us. Okay. Payable in U.S. currency only. Please do not send cash money orders and checks only. For each item ordered, please place an additional $1.50 postage and handling. New York State residents, please add 8.25 sales tax. So get out your calculators. Blue Great Merchandise, 225 Lafayette Street, New York, New York. And the address and everything's here. You have to do the subtotal and everything yourself. So if you suck at math, like back in the day and you didn't have a calculator, like you better have known somebody that was good at math or you, you could fuck up here really easy. But uh, like we have an Annihilator shirt, uh, Never Never Land, Sepultura Beneath the Remains, Sepultura, Schizophrenia, Obituary Calls of Death, Slowly We Rot, Sadist Swallowed in Black, Deicide Self-Titled, Defiance 1990 tour shirt. Oh, Separal Tour Beneath the Remains hat. Obituary Cause of Death hat. Deicide hat. $12 for each hat. $14 for each t shirt. That's fucking sick. Blue Grapes badass. And back in the day, this is how you would get stuff merchandise. So it's kind of cool, like, but I don't recommend, you know, if you like this cover, don't cut it out. But, you know, you always, you can make your, like, another cover always and whatnot, but just don't fuck up the actual, like, title, you know? Or if you're lucky enough to have a release that has, like, an O card. You know, then do whatever the fuck you want with the J card. But then there's releases like the Infernal Dominion reissue of Salvation Through Infinite Suffering. Like the O card. Really, really. Like everything about this, like, cosmetically is fucking gorgeous. I know I showed this last week, but like, why would you ruin that? And I get it. If you want to hang that up on your wall, fucking do it, man. But the only reason I'm saying that is because technically you still have your cover. So you know what you're going to be listening to. You're not going to end up like... And you, you might be like, what the fuck are you rambling about? Who loses cassettes? Well, I don't have a playable CD player. So... There are certain releases I have to dub. Like, here's Devourment, Butcher of the Week. I missed out on the um, actual cassette and vinyl reissue. So, Corpse Gristle was still rad enough to send me the CD. Now, my CD player will play CDs, but you won't get volume. But it will still record it. So these are the only tapes where I can actually see like mixing them up like cuz you have cuz I I purposely like you know make sure that like uh I'm not going to lose this stuff. 
Like, there's titles all over the fucking place. Because sometimes, like, because they do, like, they are the same, like, shells and stuff. But I try to use the blue shells for certain albums. I don't know. There's a method to everything. But there's certain tapes, like, when you start getting a lot, too, you're going to start losing some. And what I mean by losing some, like, you'll know. Like, for example, like, sometimes... I just, like, forget I have Drawing Down the Moon on cassette. Like, just because it gets lost in the fucking shuffle. Like, there's so fucking many cassettes sometimes. It's like, fuck, do I... I have that, right? Like, or do I have a double? Can I give that double to a friend? And, like, because that, that's what I normally do. Like, uh, y yesterday, uh, my buddy that sent in the Sadakist sent me um, a double I have of... Uh, Naroth or Naroth, I forget their name. I have the, the tapes in there. I don't feel like dealing with it, but you get what I'm saying. Sometimes you end up with doubles. Give them to your friends and stuff like that. You know, like let people that don't already have a copy have a copy so they can enjoy it. But when it comes to Sadakist, Necro, Duel, Dimension, Funeral Storms, Fuck yeah. Thrashing Black Death from Finland. Fuck the sun. I fucking hate it too. Long live the fucking beast. If you know what that's from, you don't win anything, but high five. Because <laughs> I wish I still had a poster from that comedy album. Because that comedy album, when I was a kid alongside of a spoiler to that answer, they're all gonna laugh at you. I thought that shit was like the funniest thing in the entire world when it first came out. But, Hell's Headbangers strikes once again with a satanic fucking slaughter here from Sadakist, Necro Duel, Dimension, Funeral, Storms. Get into this shit. From Finland. Evil as fuck. And as always, thanks for watching, you fucking rule. Hails.